back to another weekly vlog. What is up? Hold on a second. Alright, so I am... This vlog is taking off for the last vlog ended. I am currently at Hobby Lobby picking up some supplies for DIY project. I'm going to be making homemade mini mess is. Never done that before, so it's going to be very, very interesting. Um, I have an idea of what I want them to look like. We should tell you. There might be a video on them. Who knows? Alright, see you later. Hey guys, what is up? Um, so it's Sunday the 17th, I think. <laughs> uh, got sent home early from work today. Did not get a chance to vlog last night only just because there, it was less. My house was very chaotic. There was a lot going on. Um, oh, there we go. The lighting's a lot better this way. Um, with family over. My brother was over. He brought... Um, two of his kids because um his oldest had a work class night um so it's just the um it was just my niece Maya and then my nephew Andre and then my cousin one of many cousins was over last night with her dog um so that we can kind of meet him or we're possibly going to be adopting him only because um my cousin can no longer t take care of him. She has, like, a lot going on in her life. She's going back to school and is working and um, has her, her little girl that she um, has and driving her to, like, different activities and stuff. Um... And, yeah, so it's just, she doesn't want to give him up. It's the fact that she's at a point in her life where she just can't, um, uh, have a pet. So, um, yeah, so she's looking for family. She started, she's asking with family first to see if anyone in the family wants to take him. Uh, um... My mom said that um, she doesn't mind. Uh, um, so we're going to kind of test it out and see how it works. Um, we're hoping that Bailey gets along with him because that's our, that's our main <laughs> concern is Bailey. He, for some reason, Bailey just doesn't get along with other dogs. It takes him a while for him to um get used to other dogs so yeah all right i i might be working on my mini ears today we shall see i'm um i'm hoping to get them done today all right see you guys later hey guys, so it is now later on it's after 10 i um Went to my small group. That was really good. Um, these are my very first DIY um, Minnie Mouse ears, which I'm really excited how they turned out. I may add like gold trim around the bottoms of the ear so that you can't see the glue from the hot glue gun. Um, I do plan on opening my own Etsy shop selling homemade mini ears. Um, once I get the hang of it and I get to the point where like you can't really see the glue and I don't need a, a trim at the bottom, I will for sure open that up and I'll make an announcement as to when um, that happens and when it opens. Um, yeah, I, I had plans to work out today. <laughs> that did not happen. 
Um, I'm probably going to have to work out twice tomorrow, which means I'm going to have to wake up the moment my alarm goes off. My alarm gets set for 7 a.m., but I like to kind of just lay in bed for a while and just, um, you know, um, check my notifications and stuff. But, um... Yeah, I'm trying to get, like, the best lighting. Obviously, it's dark. But the lighting in my room is not that great. Anyways, um... Yeah, I definitely plan on making more and selling some on Etsy. I probably won't. I won't... There, there's... I'm, I was originally gonna, like make two of these keep one for myself and send another one to um a youtuber here who um loves beauty and a beast um but <laughs> um i decided that i am going to keep my first pair and i make another pair that's a little nicer for her um so yeah anyways i'll see you guys tomorrow Good morning guys today is uh tuesday the 19th um yeah so <laughs> it is about 8 30 i did not get up early enough to do my morning workout so i'm just gonna do one huge long workout when i get home from work um i'm really excited because my 23 Me dna kit is supposed to be coming in today um so yeah i'm really excited um, I'm going to be doing a video on that, um, although that's probably going to have to wait until next month because it takes a few weeks for the results to come in. So I'm just going to do, like, I'm going to, um, just make that one huge video where I show you guys the, like, box and the kit. And like spit inside the tube and stuff, and um, me mailing it in, and then once the results come back, I'm gonna record that as well. So you get like just one video instead of two separate videos, um, which I know a lot of people on YouTube do two separate videos where they show you the kit and they talk about it and what comes in it, and then. And then a few weeks later, they show you the results, but I, I want to do it all at the same time. So, yeah. Um, so, that's supposed to come in the mail today. Um, my, <laughs> my Disney pins from the um, Wisdom, the Dis Disney Wisdom collection are supposed to come in tomorrow. Along with a um, mini ears that I ordered from the Shop Disney app. Those are supposed to come in tomorrow. Um, I'm probably going to have them be a part of my Dis collective Disney haul. When you love Disney, you your money goes towards them. What can I say? Alright. Um, I'm probably going to get uh, start to get finish my breakfast and then start to get ready for work. I'm hoping today's <laughs> going to be slow, but highly doubt it because of the snow that we got Sunday. And we got a little bit of flurries yesterday. Not so much, but like a little bit. Um, yeah. All right. I'll see you guys later. Hey guys, what is up? I am now home from work. I've been home. I got off of work like around 745-ish. Um, and I've been home for a while now um yeah so i just kind of wanted to get get on here real quick um before i change out of my work uniform and into um my workout clothes but this bad boy it came in the mail today I'm really excited um so I, I'm not going to do this tonight because I've been drinking water all day and I just had dinner 
and you're if, um if you eat or you're not supposed to eat or drink before taking this test um if you do eat or drink you have to wait 30 minutes um <laughs> and um yeah i'm not gonna be waiting that long so yeah i just kind of want to show you this box the box and what it looks like and the, um and what to um kind of what to expect next month um so yeah tomorrow i will film the i'll be doing the video on it i'll be filming the first half of the video and then when the results come in i'll be um filming the second part of the video that way it can kind of combine both parts together combine part one and part two together um and do one just huge um video so yeah i just kind i just wanted to i'm really excited um that i'm doing this kit i don't um for those of you who don't know i am i'm mixed I'm like the first mixed kid in my family and for the longest time I was the only mixed kid in my family until um I want to say 12 13 years ago when my sister and brother-in-law um it's um had their first their first child um which is my niece Isabella and yeah so for the longest time I was the only like mixed kid in my family um and now that my uh family's growing I'm no longer the only mixed kid in my family um I've got uh let's see A, c a cousin of mine who had twins, a boy and a girl. They're half Mexican, half black. And then um, another cousin of mine whose kids are half Mexican, half white. Like I am, I'm half Mexican, half white. Um, and then my brother's kids are... Um, half Mexican, half Puerto Rican, but I don't know if you would consider that mixed or not. I When I say mixed, I mean, um, two nationalities coming together, but since they're, since Mexican and Puerto Ricans fall under the Hispanic and Latino, uh, Latino, um, community and or you know fall under the same like category uh, I don't know what <laughs> it's been a long day so if my wording just seems off <laughs> it's been a long day um so there's that and then my sister's kids are half white half Mexican um so and then oh, another cousin of mine her daughter is half Mexican, half Puerto Rican, so, um, yeah, we're just finally, my family's slowly starting to kind of branch out in, like, mix of other, um, nationalities and, um, races and stuff, so, um, kind of cool that I was the first one in my, um, uh, my parents were the first to, like, um, mix together, so, yeah, anyways, I'm, like, blabbing on and on, I don't know what my hair's doing, I swear, work hair is not the greatest, um, there we go, I look somewhat decent, anyways, I'm going to change into my, uh, workout stuff, and um get a nice workout and before going to bed 
And yeah, I will see you guys later. Hey guys, what is up today? It is the um, 20th. I just finished filming the first half of my 23andMe video. Um, be in a lookout for that within the next two-ish weeks. Um, after watching, um, excuse me, I'm like balancing like a lot of things. I'm balancing my phone in one hand and like um, two cups in another and a kit. Um, so after watching like a few 23andMe videos, uh, people have said that like it took a few weeks for the results to come in. So that's why I, um, so if that video, you see me in like a completely different outfit, um, that's why, <laughs> so yeah, um, yeah, I was scheduled a tent today, um, but work pushed me back until like 12. I'll probably go in like around 11.30 only because I know 12 o'clock means closing and I, I don't want to close. Don't want to learn to close. I've never closed in my entire life. Um, so it's just like, uh, you know, why bother, um, you know, waiting super late. Uh, for a lunch break, so yeah, that's basically what I just did this morning. Um, my hair is doing this crazy wavy thing. What happens when you let your hair air, naturally air dry? You get this crazy mess going, which I actually don't mind. I've been learning to love my like na natural hair texture and not using an, uh, a hair dryer. I, I don't use a hair dryer unless I have to. So, yeah. All right. See you guys later.